What's up, guys? I got two um, trades in the mail today. I'm probably not going to put any videos up soon because I have finals this week, but after I will be very active since it is going to be summer. So, yeah, it's going to be awesome. I'm working out a couple trades right now, but I'm not going crazy right now. But, yeah, so I got one really nice trade, but I'll show that last. But this is just a quick trade on Poke Gym from Dark Soul SP. Hey Nick, I I have to send him two Call Energies, a Spirit Tomb, Arceus, two Pokemon Collectors, and I'm sending him a Challenge Choice because I don't have a Mo Rotom. I need a Mo Rotom actually. I think I told him I was sending him Challenge. So, oh well. So yeah, you see, I just got an Azelf Level X. I still need the Uxy Level X, but this card is freaking awesome. I have the Mess Spirit, now I have the Az Elf. I had an Az Elf, but I wasn't really that much of a collector or a player back then, so I had to get it again. I pulled my first one, so that's good. Yes, that's nice. So I'm just reading what it, what it does. Alright, put that out to the side. So this, is, this next trade is really big came in a bubble mailer. I already took it out because there's so much. You can see what there's. And I sent a lot for these. Which you can probably tell when I show you what they are. So I will start with this package right here. It says three plus three red jungle. So it can give you a little basis of what's in these. This is just another addition to my collection. So first we got an Aerodactyl Rare Non-Hollow. A Haunter Rare Non-Hollow. Let me pull those out. Mint Condition. Nice cards. And we got a Raichu Rare. Kangas Kong Rare. I have the hollow already, I think. It's got some edge wear, so. But I think there's another one. But. And then we got a hollow violet plume. You can see that hollow, it's crazy. And a hollow victory bell. I basically traded for the whole hollow and rare sets for both of these. For three sets. Very nice condition. So those two. Then got a electrode clefable. Edgeway of course, but they're old cards, so it's acceptable. This one's bent a little bit. Bend it back. So yeah, those two. Flaren, which is a really cool card. Uh, there's the Genghis Kong. Cool. Yes, Flareon has a lot of edge wear, but that's fine. It's just for the collection. I'm, I don't really care about... Unless it's a really rare card, I don't really care about the quality card. Wiggly Tough. Edge wear, but still. Um, Venomoth. Vaporeon. Some more edgeware. Something like dry on it. But yeah, nice hollows. So this is one of my, f these two are my favorites. Middle Queen and Mr. Mime. Middle Queen's really cool. And it is in very nice condition. And then we got two of my other favorites. Pinsir, Scyther. And I don't think any of them are shadowless. I can't really tell. So, got... 
may have to make a part two of this, but I got. Let me just get them. There's so many cards, I gotta get them. So I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen hollows from Jungle Set. So, and then I just got four um, multiple. Oh, wait. And just got two more fossil rares. Uh, fossil rare and a jungle rare. So, yeah. So, on to the next one. The next one is every fossil hollow and three more rares. So, right off the bat, it's my favorite hollow of all. The Dragonite. And then we got a Ditto. Moltres. Raichu. Zapdos. Muck. I like four of these, so if you need one, tell me. So, Hypno. So as you can see, this is a really big trade. I've been waiting this for a while. The only card that I didn't get but I need is... Charizard base set. So we got him only. It's really cool. The hollow. Magneton. Kaboo tops. I have one of these mints, so this is for trade. Lapras. Aerodactyl hollow. Really nice. Articuno hollow. I have one of these, so this is for trade. And all the doubles you see are for trade. I have multi some non hollow rares that he gave me. Let's just go through these and tell you which ones are for trade. Wigglytuff, I think, is for trade. Kangas Kong is for trade. And yeah, out of those, yeah. And then last is the base set. Okay, got a nine tails, really nice. Polyrath, all mint condition. Let me check if any of them. I'll tell you if there's some of them are shadowless, not those. This is, I think there's like a misprint Chansey out there somewhere. It's like different coloring. I saw a kid who had one. So it was pretty cool. This kind of looks like it. Let me know. And this kind of looks shadowless. So if it is, tell me. Let's see. I don't think so, but I'm not quite sure. So I get a Chansey, Clefairy. Of course, we got a Machamp first edition. I was hoping he was gonna give me this, but so he did, and. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah. I, I, I didn't know he was going to give me the first edition one. I thought he was going to get a red one. Magneton. This is also my favorite card. Needle King. Mewtwo Base. Alakazam Base. Blastoise! Oh, sorry, I just had to do that from that YouTube video. If you haven't seen it, look it up. It's funny. It's hilarious. So we got Blastoise Base. Raichu Base. And a Venusaur Base. So yeah, I need the Charizard. And wait, what's this? Oh, Zapdos. And Gyarados and Hitmonchan. So this was from this was from one Pokemon Master. He's on Poke Beach 2. He gave me a dump load of cards. Like, sorry about that. Like, crazy amount. And they are all hollows and rares. So, this is an amazing trade. I think I sent him, like, two full legends from Huckle Till Silver. Uh, Gyarados EX. And two level X's. But I needed the cards. 
so he sent me like that many cards all hollows so that's really cool and in the back you can see holding up holding an ammo. I usually put something there and show you guys something different every time I got my Mewtwo and my Pikachu metal coins so okay peace out subscribe rate comment see ya